Captain's Log, Ramsey's reporting. Starfleet has asked us to review the Simeon application for Federation membership. The first step to Federation membership is that they must demonstrate the ability to conduct interstellar travel via warp drive. The Simeons have recently proven such a feat. Where did they get their space technology from? Did they acquire it through research and development? Or did they steal it? Prime Minister Zayas requested Federation membership. The Federation is very puzzled as to how a civilization of apes could be so primitive and yet so advanced as to discover warp drive. Such a paradox. I thought it best to take a shuttlecraft to explore the planet rather than beam down directly into Ape City. I wanted to get a better feel for the lay of the land for our survey. Our mission is to engage the Simian culture and determine their suitability for Federation membership. We discovered that this is a parallel Earth where mankind fell and became dominated by a civilization of intelligent apes. There was an advanced human culture at one time, but it was destroyed in a catastrophic nuclear war. The humans never fully recovered after the war, but the apes rose to power to dominate the planet. We've been monitoring ape activity. Whatever they're up to, it looks very sinister, like they're preparing for a major military operation. When we first landed at the ape capital, the apes did not take very kindly to our arrival. In spite of their invitation, they were not very pleased to see us. Captain Ramsey's United Federation of Planets, we come in peace! Then they gave us a sampling of their hospitality. We defended ourselves, of course. We only applied enough force to discourage the apes from attacking us. The apes would strongly disagree, of course. Finally, Zaius and his staff arrived to stop the violence. Later, Prime Minister Zaius apologized and said it was all a big misunderstanding. The apes, you see, are not used to seeing strange humans roam freely in their city. Zaius granted us free access to their cities in order for us to study their society and culture. We found it rather shocking how they treated and regarded humans. From outward appearances, the apes did not reflect a spacefaring people. Their museums were simply disgusting. And the mystery deepens.